Ciao a tutti, today I would like to show you how to evolve one sound by transforming it into another, <laughs> just like the caterpillar and the butterfly. Because, uh, in my opinion, evolving sounds are great to make our production uh, more interesting. And to do it, I'm going to use the Alchemy. Alchemy is a great, great, great software instrument. So, let's add a software instrument track. And from here, I will choose Alchemy. I don't need the library, I don't need the inspector, but I will just open the Alchemy and I will initialize setting. Initializing setting, Alchemy view is going directly to advanced in, in where I will have just one so loaded. Come on, K. Okay, here we have uh, four sources that we can use in order to make a morphing. I go directly to the morph pad in which I can transform one sample, one source into another. Let's start importing uh, something. Uh, just single click into so, import audio. And they can have many, many dif different sources like alchemy samples, access factory samples, sample instrument, and so on. I will import now uh, an alchemy sample, for example, a pad, digital, beautiful sky, it's okay. I choose all. <laughs> All the samples that are here are okay, so I can map all my keyboard. And I will use Add and Spec Analysis Mode because it's the most suitable if I'm dealing with pitched and uh, monophonic sound. Formant should be on, and then I just drag them in the drop zone and I import. Okay, let me see. I drag my XY pad, XY pad in the A position. Let me see if it's working. It's working. Okay, now we'll import something else in the B. Uh, I can import something from the access factory farm or from sample instrument. Let's see here. Sample instrument world, North American. What is that? A flute is okay. I will import it. A pad into a flute. Uh, different pitch sound. I will import now something else. I can import also my personal documents, my personal audio. For example, here I have a uh, a voices from Ricardo. Don't care about how, don't care about how you play. So imagine you have some recording and you want to transform, for example, one recording into a piano. You can do it. I will import this. Then I was talking about piano. Why, why not use a piano also? Let me hear keyboards, keyboard collection. Hmm. Mm. 
no, questi pianos, ok, mi manca ancora un piano. It will take a little bit to load everything in my alchemy. It's taking too much. Let's choose something else. For example, I have a tamper or something like that. No. Mm -hmm. Let piano. I didn't want to make you losing too much time, that's why I, I cancelled the import of the piano. But you can use it, of course. Now let's see what happened. Sorry, Ricardo. Here I can set the volume of the piano. Don't care about how you play. Don't care about how. And also set the semitone, the tone. Don't care about how you play. And what I can do also is add an arpeggiato where I want. For example, I want to arpeggiate the flute, just the flute. I can do it. I set, sorry, not all, but only the flute on. And why not? Also Ricardo. Don't care about how we... So see. Now, what I'm going to do, I'm going to add, for example, a pad, a normal pad from here. going to add the pad here below. Why below? Because if not was changing my sound. And I put it up right here. Okay, now I will enable the automation. I will decide for large mode, so will keep my my, posi my position. Play. Don't, 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 don't. 
Let's loop the region. And start again. Not recording, please. Not metronome, please. Play. I hope you understand the, the what I try to show you. Uh, full improvisation, so some errors in my video as, as usual, and sorry for my English. Thank you for watching and have a nice day. Ciao a tutti. Ciao.